in the human plane, we can actually hear the Buddha's teachings yeah. and we can put them into practice. Mm. If you're born as a cat, the yeah. cat could be sitting here listening to the Buddha's teachings, but the cat isn't going to understand it very much. If you're in a heavenly plane, you can hear the Buddha's teachings, but you're having such a nice time, you don't, have, you don't feel motivated to yeah. do anything else. But it, yeah, that's cool. I like it. So we talk, about, we talk about the precious human birth, because to be born as a human being is a very special event because we can hear and practice the Buddha's teachings. And that's only true at the moment. We're very fortunate that we are living at a time when the teachings are known. The Buddha said that eventually these teachings will become corrupt and then they'll be forgotten until after a long, long, long time, another Buddha will arise. We're also fortunate that we're living in a place where we can hear these teachings. There are parts of the world where they never heard of the word Buddhism. They never heard of Dhamma. <laughs> I think there are parts of the world where they just not heard about Buddhism or even remotely like Buddhism. Mm. 